for more information related to the civil engineering concepts and civil engineering updates please visit my website civilbasics123.com go to type civilbasics123.com in google so that my website will be open here like this so which is consisting of all detailed concepts related to the civil engineering topics so please follow my website civilbasics123.com in this video lecture i will explain you complete combined footing of g plus 3 building structural model by using stat pro v8 software so basically combined footing will be helpful for designing of the uh, distance between the column which is less than 8 feet section okay in this video i will explain you how to design the building structure by using combined footing formation in stat pro v8 software okay so for that firstly i will show you the model which i was done by using stat pro v8 software so this is my building model so initially i will measure the center to center distance between the each column just i am selecting the first point second point it will be consisting of 2.5 meter and this is the 2.4 meter okay so again in the same process i will show you the height of the particular structure this is a starting point again this is the ending point it will be consisting of 15 meter height okay so for the the far is respected building structure i was taken the beam size which is consisting of approximately Uh, 0.35 cross 0.23 and column is 0.46 cross 0.23 and plate thickness is approximately equal to 150 mm and I was taken the load cases which is comes under the seismic loading condition effect as well as the wind loading condition effect. Okay, so I was taken the combination which is included for that particular structural cases. Okay, so after uh, doing the analysis process, we need to design the structure. So So for this respected building design section, I was taking the uh, building design consideration related to the M30 grade concrete, FE4 and 5 grade steel for the respected consideration. Okay. So after uh, doing the designing process, we need to check the reinforcement value for the respected beam section, column section. Next, I am selecting this particular beam. Click on this point. So now we can see this is the beam reinforcement details for the respected corner column, which is consist uh, beam, which is consisting of four bars of 12 mm diameter at this particular location, and it will be consisting of two bars of 12 mm diameter at this particular location. In the same process, I will show you the column reinforcement details. Just I am selecting this particular column. Click on the concrete design. So now we can see it is required approximately uh, 12 number of the 16 mm diameter bar, and these are the design parameters which is comes under this column design. So after designing this beam sections, column sections, we need to design the foundation for the building structure as per the consideration. So for that, firstly we need to click on the foundation design. So here we have to select the load cases which is related to the dead loading, live loading, as well as the a uh, seismic loading condition so click on the run stat foundation software the fixed supports will be directly imported to the stat foundation software it will be consisting of your respected uh, uh, node point sections here like this so firstly we have to generate the load combination related to this particular section so for that click on the loads and factors option click on the create uh, load cases option so click on the generate load cases option So here I am selecting as per the Indian standard system. It will be consisting of the codes like A C E, uh, N B C C, Indian, British, Australian code and other user defined code also. So you can click on the Indian standard system. Click on the generate load combination for the service load combination initially. Again in the same process we have to click on the generate load combination for the ultimate load combination so that it will develop the parameters as per the consideration. So after that we have to design the combined footing for this respected structural cases. So for that click on the job setup option, create new job option. So in this case initially we need to give the job name. Just I am giving here as combined footing C O M B. So again we have to select the job type. So in the job type it will be consisting of the foundations like isolated footing, pile cap footing, mat footing, combined footing. So as per our requirement we need to select the combined footing itself. Again design code will be consisting of uh, types here like this which is cons consisting of US code, British code, Indian code, Australian code, Canadian code and Chinese code. So you can select the Indian standard systems only. And we have to select the default units as per the SI system only not the English system. So that's why just I am considering SI. So again support condition we have to consider assigned to the selected support assigned to the listed supports or assigned to the all support so here combined footing is required for this respected g plus 3 building structural model for the all support conditions only just i'm selecting all the supports so now we have to select the load combination just i'm selecting 1 2 3 4 5 6 load combination so click on include option so directly click on the create job option so that it will develop the combined footing design results as per the consideration on the left hand side section here like this okay but firstly we have to add the uh, strip condition system for the respected all supports so these are the all supports which is exist for the building structure 
So for that initially we need to select any one of the corner foundation again in the same process we have to select the opposite foundation okay now we can see i have selected this we need to add the strip for this particular structure click on uh, create from uh, selected node to node so now we can see it was developed the combination of this respected particular section of the combined footing for this two node points in the same process we have to develop the another strip condition system for the footings so here i am developing the footing section which is related to the support number three and support number four for the particular structure here like this in the same process we have to develop the combined footing for the respected considerations Now we can see here all the strips are assigned for this respected consideration. So here I was forgot to add the strips. Just I am selecting first point, second point. Let us consider. Again I am selecting first point, second point. Click on add option. Now we can see all the strips are added for this respected consideration. So again we have to select this combined footing, concrete and rebar value. Just we have to select the 25 and these are the standard values. But if you want to change that particular value, you can change. Soil and uh, cover type. Just I am selecting the bearing capacity is approximately 200. Click on the footing and geometry. Click on the directly design option. Click on S option. So that it will start designing of your respected footing design results as per the IS 456-2000 codal provision standard system. Then after that we can able to see the all detailed calculation part as per IS 456-2000 codal provision. So it will take some time for analysis of this particular structure. Now we can see here it was done with ISL uh, combined footing design for the respected foundation as per IS456. So this is geometry, this is a details and drawing for that respected footing. So it will be consisting of complete detail uh, calculation part which is comes under this footing design results. Okay, so it will be consisting of the reinforcement values here like this for the respected combined footing one and combined footing two. Okay, so this is a GA drawing. This is the complete calculation sheet which is included for this particular ice combined footing section. So just I am selecting combined footing 14. It will be consisting of all detailed calculations as per IS 456-2000 code. So this is a calculation sheet. These are the graphs which is comes under the uh, shear force versus length of that particular building and this is the bending moment versus length of that particular building structure okay so again it will be consisting of your respected calculation sheet here like this okay so this is the complete process of uh, combined footing design by using uh, stat pro v8 software as per the is 456 2000 codal provision for the respected g play 3 building structural model uh, if you have any queries about this respected video please try to text me your questions in the below comment box I will try to give the answer for that respected questions. Thank you.